I'm gonna talk about Uber's 25% uh, uh, rates and what changed. And I've been driving for uh, the past, uh, from since it went in effect till today. Today is the, the 20th of uh, January. So right now, when the new effects went into play and the new price increase and uh, what Uber claims to say that they no longer are doing fixed uh, fixed uh, rates for passengers, Uber right now is suffering and nobody is taking Uber rides. There's way less amount of demand of Uber rides than there was last year. Uh, at the end of last year, almost at the end, I noticed there was a big, big drop. So I thought it was because of uh, people were saving money, people weren't trying to spend. And yeah, people are not trying to spend money. People are not trying to uh, pay a lot of money for rides. So right now what people are doing, they are going to Lyft and they are, are, they are paying uh, less with Lyft because they know what they're paying. And uh, I think Uber, uh, their rates went up. So right now Uber is not profitable as a driver. Uh, I recommend uh, having both apps on at the same time because there, uh, there's no money right now with Uber. There's certain, there is Uber money, but not consistent. So you turn on the Lyft app, you get ride after ride after ride. With Uber, you are having to wait five to 10 minutes per ride for another pickup unless there's a demand in the area you're in. Uh, and it gets a little difficult because you have the option of knowing exactly where you're going and how much you're making. So you tend to not accept every ride because you notice that you get constant like two to three dollar rides constantly so you'd rather wait for that long that long ride that big ride which sometimes doesn't come so you end up wasting that that long of time with uber instead of lyft not knowing where you're going so you accept every ride because you it's a guessing game with uh, or lyft but you also accept the rides and you keep making money as you're going which you might not make that much but you're still gonna make money while uh, while accepting rides then not accepting rides so i recommend using both companies at the same time so you can maximize your earnings that's what my opinion is for the new 2020 year with rideshare